Okay, so my next step in my privacy project after getting rid of all things Google is to switch to Linux on my computers. I had a file server running Windows 10, but uh, I don't like that Microsoft can collect user data and sell that to advertisers and so on and using my user data for anything they want and so on. I don't like that a large corporate uh, business can uh, collect my data and use that for what they want and so on. So I decided to change my file server at home to a Linux server. So I installed Ubuntu on my Windows 10 laptop and made that as a file server running every server I want and so on. Plex servers, MB servers, Calibre servers and all that. So now I have a Linux file server at home and I was so amazed by how good Linux actually is. Linux makes every old computer as new again. Computers get so much faster with much higher performance and so on. Much higher performance. So um, a, a bit old computer can be very very fast and you can use it as a new computer again. And I realized that now when I installed Ubuntu on this Windows 10 laptop. Now it's so fast and totally quiet. It never gets warm or anything. So it's totally quiet and cool. And I love that because it does a lot of stuff for me but still so quiet. And after that I decided to install Linux on my old MacBook Air too. My MacBook Air is from 2012 and it starts to get very old running the latest macOS version and so on. And after a while it uses all my RAM, 8 GB of RAM and so on and starts to get so hot and uh, the the fans are very high uh, sound and so on and the complete MacBook Air is so hot to hold and all that. So I decided to install Linux on that one too. And first I choose the Manjaro distro, Linux Manjaro. And it was okay. Uh, it uses the XDFCE user interface and so on. And uh, it looks uh, okay and not so good as I have wanted and so on. And it should be so light on uh, the hardware and all that. But uh, I wasn't satisfied with it because the MacBook Air still got very, very hot. And even if um, the processor didn't uh, use so much uh, anymore and so on, and uh, the RAM memory was only just about one gigabyte of RAM of usage, instead of 8 gigabytes when I use it with Mac OS. So that was very, very good, but it still got very, very hot. So I decided to install Ubuntu on that too. And I'm so happy that I switched from Manjaro to Ubuntu because now it's not hot anymore. The fans doesn't start and everything. And it still uses only one gigabyte of RAM memory when I use it instead of eight when I used it as a Mac. So now I have a MacBook Air running Linux and I can finally use it again. The battery life was terrible when uh, I used macOS. One and a half, maybe two hours of battery life at the most. Now I can easily have four hours of battery life again with running Ubuntu. And four hours of battery life on a 2012 MacBook Air. I think that's great actually. So I'm very very happy because now I can use a, a laptop while uh, watching YouTube videos and so on. Uh, and, uh, and if I want to watch a movie somewhere else than uh, on the TV or on the monitor here in the studio, I can use the laptop to watch uh, videos on and so on. So now I have uh, a laptop laptop running Ubuntu Linux 
I'm MacBook Air running Ubuntu Linux and I have a laptop running Ubuntu Linux as a file server at home. And my main computer is still the iPhone XS Max. I use that for most of the stuff I do. Uh, video recording, video editing uh, and so on. And uh, the computers for everything else. A file server and, and sometimes a laptop to watch movies on. So I'm very very happy with this and everything was for the privacy issues. Linux is open source, free open source and you don't have any trackers in Linux. You don't have a corporate business collecting user data about you and so on. It has total privacy for the user and I really love that. And you don't get viruses, you don't get any malware or anything on Linux. It feels so good to know that you now have computers with an operating system that doesn't collect any user data at all about you. You can really trust the free open source operating system Linux here. You can highly trust it for your privacy. So I'm very very happy with Linux now. So Linux operating system is so fun to learn about. It's so fun to learn everything I can do with Linux and so on. So now I'm listening to Linux podcast. I'm reading Linux books and I read a lot of articles about Linux and I follow Linux uh, subreddits on Reddit and all that. So I am so happy with Linux at the moment. Okay. Bye.